And here is a quick example of how to use the coefficient of performance in how the refrigerator does work and how it expels heat to the hot reservoir and how it takes heat in from the cold reservoir. So remember the equation that uh, K, the coefficient of performance, is equal to the amount of heat that we grab out of the refrigerator, so that's Q cold, divided by the amount of work we do to accomplish that. And so in this case, K is 2.5, which actually is pretty low for a refrigerator. If the refrigerator in the store had a performance of 2.5, you wouldn't want to buy it. You want something with a little bit better performance than that. But let's say in our example, let's say that's okay. So the first thing we want to do here is see that we have K, we have Q cold, we can figure out what W is, the amount of work done to accomplish that. So W is equal to QC divided by K simply by exchanging these two variables. So in this case, it's equal to 3,800 joules and the K is 2.5. And so the amount of work that it takes to do that for every 3,800 3, joules of heat that we get out of the refrigerator, is 1520 joules. So what this means is that the compressor has to do 1520 joules of work in order to extract 3800 joules of heat out of the refrigerator. I think that's a pretty good deal. And then how do we find QH? Well that's still the same. You can say that QH is equal to the work plus Q cold and you can of course see that on this, on this uh, diagram work plus Q cold equals Q hot and so this is equal to 1520 joules plus 3800 joules and together that looks like it's 4320 oh not 4000 I'm missing a thousand uh, that would be 5320 joules which is the heat expelled to the environment. So now the question is, could you, for example, use your refrigerator to cool the kitchen? Hmm. So what if you left the door open and so then, of course, the refrigerator would be working, uh, heat would be going into the refrigerator, then the refrigerator would then take that heat and expel to the kitchen and would then the kitchen become cooler? And the answer is no, because you would only take 3,800 joules of heat out of the kitchen through the refrigerator and then you would expel back into the kitchen a total of 5,320 joules. So actually, if you leave the refrigerator open, you're just going to make the kitchen hotter, not colder. Hmm. So not a good idea to use a refrigerator for that. Now, if you could take your refrigerator and roll it to the front door and have the part that expels the heat pointed outwards, and then you kind of uh, seal off the, any openings that are left in the door, then you would take 3,800 of joules of heat out of the house, and then the heat would be expelled, the 5,320 joules would be expelled to the outside, and then you could cool your house. So if it gets really hot in your house, and you don't have an air conditioner, and don't care about the food in your refrigerator, you can actually use it to cool your house. Hmm, that's pretty neat, but you have to stick the back end of the refrigerator out the front door so the heat goes out and doesn't stay in the house. That's how you do that.